What's going on everybody? Welcome back to Married to Film. I'm Ralph, this is Shamanda. And if this is your first time with us, we are a married couple that loves to watch movies, talk about movies and TV shows, and we love each other. So if this is something you'd be interested in, don't hesitate to go ahead and hit that subscribe button. As for right now, we're getting ready to uh, review the movie Mission Impossible Fallout, starring Tom Cruise and Henry Cavill and the rest of the cast and characters. Uh, it was directed by Christopher McQuarrie. He did the last one, he did Rogue Nation, and he also did Jack Reacher. So him and uh, Tom Cruise have a rapport there. So, let's go ahead and get into it. Go ahead and knock it out the park. I probably don't wanna talk about the actual movie, but that contract that Tom Cruise has <laughs> for running in every film that he's in, I don't think y'all understand the form that this dude has and the simple fact that he still looks like he's from the cat from Top Gun. He hasn't really aged. You no. can tell a little bit the crow's feet. Mm. But other than that, he ain't got no wrinkles here. <laughs> like his face don't drag down. And he ain't got that, you know, that... That down there. Mm. <laughs> but his form, as his far form as his is running... Nice. He yes, has to have it in his contract. Hilarious. Because it's not just a quick dart from here to there. No. He runs for ages. <laughs> like the one where he was running in a sandstorm. Oh, yeah. That was Ghost Protocol. Yeah. <laughs> he was running for it. But his head. Oh. He is gone. Man. And I just be like this every time he runs. It is multiple times in every movie. It's crazy. Every movie. And I was like, <laughs> he got to get off that motorcycle and just go ahead and run. And he did. Ooh. And it was amazing. Um, this particular film, Fallout, um, I understand the title of it. Once you see it, you'll, you'll understand the title of why they call it Fallout. Um, so you really have to see it. I'm, try I'm trying to be very, 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 very careful <laughs> not to spoil this for you guys because you really have to go see it. And um, the storyline, of course, with Mission Impossible, they stay with the storyline throughout the whole thing. You know what their mission is from the very beginning, mm -hmm. from the time the thing self-destructs, and from the time on, you know exactly what's going to happen. Of course, it's going to be plot twist throughout the whole thing because you don't know who and, and, and when who can be trusted. <laughs> I'll put it that right, way. Right, right. So the storyline was pretty good. It was pretty interesting. It had a whole lot of um, um, interesting faces to come about. Um, uh, yeah, and that's basically all I can say about that. <laughs> um, old love interest. <laughs> and a lot of, you know, his his, his original crew was back. Mm. Which we love, Ving Rhymes and um, um, Simon Pig. Simon Pig. I want to call him Steve too. <laughs> then you have Superman in here. Henry Cavill. He looked like a Steve. <laughs> Henry Cavill. He's in there, and then Angela Bassett. Mm-hmm. Doing her thing. I mean, I the character that she had in um, Waiting to Excel. You would have thought that she would have put a weave on and tossed her cigarette and walked away <laughs> in this joint. <laughs> It was pretty good. You have to go see the movie, and I'm, I'm gonna try to say not much. The action killed. When I say killed, it was a Mission Impossible movie. The action was awesome. That bathroom scene, it went on. It felt like it went on forever, but I was okay with that. I was okay that it went on forever. Wrap it up. <laughs> I know you ain't talking. I know you ain't talking. <laughs> All right, I'm done. I'm gonna let this cat carry on. Uh, yeah, continuing uh from what she what she was talking about. You you know what? It, it's been so many Mission Impossible's. You know what you're getting into when you go see one of these movies. It's just action packed and Tom Cruise running and you know <laughs> trying running, to running, <laughs> run, running, 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 running. <laughs> And trying to, you know, defeat the bad guys. But like she was saying, the action scenes were were shot real well. Like she mentioned, the bathroom scene. Um, it was intense. 
uh, and I like the, the the camera angles they use. I like the camera angles they use when it was, it was a motorcycle chase scene, mm. and they did some great things with the camera work on there uh, that I really liked. So that the, that action sequence was really really done well. No stunt double. <laughs> you know, Tom Cruise like Tom do, do his own thing. Tom Cruise on that <laughs> motorcycle with his foot out like this, <laughs> taking up curves. Killer. Yeah, that and um, yeah, man, Tom Cruise. You know, he actually injured himself. Um, Oh man, the battery is dying. Get out of here. But he actually, let me see how much time we got. He actually injured himself in this one, um, jumping from building to building. Um, but uh, I give him all the credit in the world to be up there in age and still want to do his own stunts. Him and Jackie Chan, man, mad, mad love to both of them. Mm -hmm. But this movie, um, like there's, there's twists and turns. Um, it's kind of long, so you know, stay in there. But I think it's, 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 it's well worth it in the end. Um, um, trying to think. Uh, oh, the score was done well. You know, the, the uh, score helped push the movie along. Yes, I thought it, I thought that did real well. Um, trying to uh, get to my my rating. Go ahead, get with your rating because I don't want to. Uh, um, I'm I'm definitely going to get it. Give it an A one. Okay. I'm gonna give it an A one. I'm gonna give it that. Um, two lobster tails may be a little bit too much, but I will give it that lobster like that lobster tail. One thing I forgot that about this uh, towards the end. With the with the uh, Tom Cruise and the uh, the the bad guy, I was like, and both of them I was like, why won't you die? You can't win, Bowers. Why won't you die? <laughs> but um, for me, I'm gonna give this one. Um, I'm gonna give it a strong B52. That's what I'm gonna give it. I thought it was really good, but I just couldn't. For some reason, I couldn't put it over the top. I don't know what it was for me. I didn't say it was over the top. I just said A1. Okay. Because it's a Mission Impossible. Yeah. You got to think about the categories that we give it. Just because it's a B-52 or A-1, it doesn't mean that it's the one of our best true, movies. True, 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 true. Um, everything about it, the score, the, the camera shots, the action, the storyline, everything else, it, it signifies an A-1 movie. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to give it a strong B-52. And, um... Go see it. Go see it, man. Uh, don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe to this channel. And we love y'all, man. Sorry we're so quick, but the battery is dying, and we wanted to get all that in before it conked out on us. <laughs> we'll see y'all next time. Love you guys. Bye. Bye.